Hi everybody, this is Sam with Python Basics and we are going to be picking up where we left off last time. And I said we are going to be doing more with for loops, but how about we do more with um, strings and things we can and cannot do with strings. So alright, let's just get back to it. Assigning Python Basics. To the variable name name okay so we remember slicing and we use our brackets for slicing how will we touch more on that so we have so the first if it's a single number it's an instance and we start at zero is the first position so then the fourth position would be that'd be the fifth letter one one two three four five now this is what was a little tricky for me alright when you start using the uh, start stop and step let me show you this this is the equivalent you don't actually have to use them but if you can get around here, all right. I will we'll, we'll just show you. Uh, I do better. I learned better by showing. Okay, so that was saying start at, start at the first position and go up to, but do not include the fifth position. Well, let me show you this. If you don't, again, there are times and programmers lazy. Look, if you can leave out zero, and it says it goes up until. All right. So this is also the same with the stop so start with this and go until the end go until the end it says start it here and go until it finishes you don't have to know what it is alright this also works for start stop and step every other letter start at the beginning well here I'll show you this to, to prove to you you don't even have to put everything in there and you get everything it's blank so that means start at the beginning because that's the start go all the way to the end that's the stop and the default step is one so use all of them and it's the same as this same thing so alright now we talked about um, that we were going to use more for loops a little bit so let's just throw this out I think we did this in the first one so now it's going to do a for loop through remember how we did range and it was going to go through each of the letters the grouping it's going to sit there and wait and it's going to go through each time and print each letter all the way down, including the spacing. So, all right. Um, now, now let's learn about concatenation. Uh, first name, we're going to change, fn is for first name, equals python. Last name, basics. Now, concatenation is a fancy term for being able to add. So that's literally what you can do in with Python. You can literally just add these together. Well, that's not exactly quite right because it needs to have a space in there. And this, here, let's just show you this. This took me a while. That's still, that's a string. It's an empty, it's, uh, it's a string of a space because it still needs to be included. So, so now this is how we get a space in between our strings. So we're just going to keep building and keep adding to this. Hope you guys are getting something out of it. Thanks for watching. See you next time.